Yo, what's up guys, and we're here with a deep bound solo progression, and we're actually going to be progressing the best PvE build currently in Deep Booking. Now, I know a lot of PvE builds right now are kind of ruined because of the Lose Your Mind nerf and old good PvE builds like the ROMs PvE build is no longer obtainable because of the Shrine of Order nerfs. So on a, I know a lot of people are asking, huh, what's the newest best PvE build? And me and my friend Flopping Man cooked up a build that does over 2,000 damage and M1. So I'm going to be progressing that today and let's get right to it. And before I do, please subscribe. And if you do, I'll mail this kitty or puppy to your house. It really just depends on which one you like more. And let's get to progressing. So this is going to be just a solo prog deep bound. And what we're going to level up first is willpower, fortitude, and strength all at the same time. So I can get my levels up and not doing like little baby damage as well. So uh, let's just buy a training vest real quick. Perfect. Oh, it's corrupted. If this guy hits me once, it's over for me. But if he doesn't... Youch. Oh wait, there's a jellyfish coming my way. Oh lord, he coming. Oh, we have a deep bound freshie here. We have two deep bound freshies to help me with this giant monster. Come on, we got this, guys. I see a health pack right there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the divers as a health pack. Wait, that's... Oh wait, damn. Where did that come from? There we go. We teeing up on this guy. Come on. Let's tee up. Alright. We killed the lionfish. I think I can level up now. Let me let me level up my willpower and stuff like that. And let's try our training vest. Oh, we need a... I'm not going to lie. We need a uh, boulder so we can train our fortitude way faster. Mr. Merchant, please take my items. All of it. I mean, they're trying though. I'm not going to lie. They are trying. Let me just increase my fortitude. Yeah, it's a corrupted jellyfish. We are definitely not beating that. No! He's coming after us! Oh my god! Oh my god! How am I supposed to get out? There's, that's an owl. And some guy just wiped. That's an owl and some guy just wiped. And I have two minutes on my combat tag thing. The only thing I can do now is just pray. Oh. Wait. Help! 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 Help me, please! Help! I don't have enough agility. Oh my god! This guy saved me! Thank <laughs> you! The praying worked! The praying worked! He said here? Thank you! Oh my god! And he gave me an spear. Oh my god! What are we gonna do about this jellyfish? No! Our friend wiped! God damn it! And that guy's corrupted so we can't even beat him. Alright, let's just keep journey on outward. Actually, I need to get stronger, so I'm just gonna level up by just purely training my willpower first. Super, so. Alright, I just need to train. I, I wanna level up as much as possible until I need EXP, because I killed a lionfish, so I'm pretty sure I have enough um, EXP. Alright, let's keep training our willpower. Yeah, there we go, he's gonna help us. Oh, we recruited someone to help us. There we go, let's, let's box this guy up. Come on. Oh my god, he died so fast. There we go. Bro, I'm a diver! Why are you attacking me? Actually, I don't want a grip, I'm not gonna lie. Let me just level up. And I'm just gonna go Vitality for now. There we go. Alright. I'm gonna keep leveling up everything then. What I like to do to level things up faster, to level up my both strength and willpower, is while I'm praying, right? I can actually spam the dumbbell. It's like level up two stats at once, so it's pretty efficient. Let me show you guys. So, I have 59 notes, so I can buy two dumbbells, and this is what I'm just gonna do. Bam! We're being efficient with it. We're speed running the stats. So let's just do this for a couple couple minutes. All I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna train until I have um I'm just gonna train until it tells me, oh, I learned as much as I can. And then I'm gonna go kill some mobs because I want to get as much levels as possible until I can fight mobs because right now I'm a freshie, I do no damage and I don't want to wipe, so. Alright, there we go, we leveled up. We have 11 strength, 10 fortitude, 36 charisma. Uh, Alright, what I'm gonna get now is I'm gonna just get carnivore and I'm also just gonna go uh, vitality. There we go. And let's just keep leveling up again until we have to get EXP. Just like last time. Alright, let's see. 
We leveled up. Let's see what we get. Uh, I'm gonna burn Loot Skipper. I'm gonna get Last Resort. Also, I don't know who this guy is. He just knows I'm Supa and he wants to be around me. It's still a solo prog, don't worry. Alright, I server hopped. So like, this could be a solo progression. And um, let's kill a single mob for EXP and we might be able to level up. But I'm surprised off like two mobs that we killed, we got to level 6. So that's pretty impressive. Uh, is that guy corrupted? Let's see. If not corrupted, I can beat it probably. Oh yeah, I can beat this guy pretty easily. Hold on. I'm actually scared. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm dipping. Hey you, hey, you got that, bro. Hey, yeah, you got that, bro. Come on. Let me just hit you. There we go. Wait, that's a thresher. There's a thresher coming my way. Oh my god, there's a king thresher blocking the entrance, the exit too. The king thresher's chasing me. Wait, yeah. The king thresher and the actual thresher's chasing me. I need to run to cast a light quickly. And there's a jellyfish blocking my path. Okay, wait. I need to uh, I need to run fast. Guards, help me, please. Help. 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 There we go. He's getting beat up now. All right, let's uh, let's just heal real quick. And then we have to kill a single mob for just the EXP pack. So we can level up a little bit more. We're already level 4. So, uh... At, also, guys, I forgot to mention that at level 10, I actually have a DVM set, set that I'm going to equip. Just to make things a little bit easier. Um, it's like 60%, I think. So yeah, once we get level 10, I'm going to equip that. Alright, let me find out jellyfish or something. I wanted to help that guy, but this guy started coming on me. All right, okay, pause. Pause. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. The guy died. The guy definitely died. Oh lord. And there's a shark over here too. Oh lord. Oh lord. Like, get me out of here now. Get me out. Get me out. Oh lord, they're coming. Alright. There we go. We'll have the divers handle them. Jesus. Let me try to fight the shark, though. Come on. Let's kill this beast. Oh, it's Ira on me, please. There we go. Come on, we got this. The NPCs are my friends. Oh my god. Why did that do so much damage? Huh. Wow, I've never been more surprised that an NPC actually did their job. Okay, so we we killed a we killed two mobs. So let's just level up now. Let's go back to what we were doing before. Oh, we leveled up. Alright, um, we don't need Bulldozer because it's not a PvE build, so we're just going to burn that. We're actually going to get Conquer Your Fears. And we're actually, we're actually going to get Strong Left purely for Squibbo. So, Squibbos d don't know how to parry Mantras, so if you use Strong Left, it one-shots them. So, uh, it's very good, especially in Hell Mode, because they're the parry demons, and so you pull out the Strong Left, so. Alright, I'm just going to sell items for notes. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna sell these. I'm gonna sell these items real quick. Oh wait, that's monster armor. Perfect. All right, we leveled up once again. Let's see what we get. All right, so I'm gonna burn defiance because I really do not need this. I'm also gonna get charge return, and I'm just gonna go proficiency. There we go. Alright guys, um, what I want to do now is I just want to go to Akira real quick and get him back to Castle Light. And hopefully, hopefully we can train our Fortitude on the way there as well. So we'll see. But yeah, this progression is going really good so far. I've killed maybe like 4 mobs and I'm already level 7. So guys, the deep bound EXP is crazy, it's crazy good. Oh, perfect. 
It's inside the chest. I'm trying to look for a shield because I need turtle shell. Turtle shell is a central talent to have because basically, if you have a shield, right? If you put it on your back, all damage from behind is reduced by 35%, which you're always going to be hit by the back in, in hell mode and like PVE. So it's basically a 35% damage re reduction at all times, which is really, really good. It's actually a central talent that you definitely need always. Oh, there you are, Kira. Alright. Oh, I hear a mob as well. Where's that? Oh, is that King Thresher? Uh oh. Yeah, you guys got that. I'm not gonna lie. This one, Sanity, must have crumbled. I know the line way too well. So be it. Boom. Hello! Wait, I'm not with them. Research platoon, who are you? Alright, Kira, I'm gonna meet you at Castle Light. Bro, I hate how jellyfish is always like ruined. There we go. Come here. Perfect. Oh my god. I already know we got like two levels from that one charco. Definitely. Oh my god, a 19 HP star boots. Holy. Actually, that's really good. I'm just gonna, like, I'm literally just gonna get everything here. Alright. We can equip those star boots at level 10. Also, we have the DVM set that I want to equip at level 10 as well. There we go. Let's find the chest. Oh, the chest is down there. Oh, uh, uh, an owl! Hold on, wait. 3 HP ring, we take those. Okay, we take this. Why is an owl there? I'm gonna fight it. Hold on, let me equip this first. All right, now I'll fight it. Oh my God, he's dead. Yes. Oh my God, I was so scared for my life. Let's see, let's see if it was worth it. Oh, four percent monster uh, damage earrings. It kind of was worth it. I'm not gonna lie. Jesus, that was so scary. Hello, Kira. Please uncap my willpower. And let's just train my willpower real quick. Let's go to 80. 80 willpower should be fine. Also, I want to get the 30 fortitude as well, so let me just do this real quick. For every jellyfish I see, that's I'm going to use one boulder. Uh, let me not get too low, I'm not going to lie. Let me just kill this jellyfish real quick. Come on, a little bit more. There we go. And there's a jellyfish over there, so let me just keep going. Come on, give me one investment point. There we go. Is that Croco? How much how, about, how much Crocos are there? All right, let me aggro one. Let me aggro literally just one. I aggroed both of them. Divers, help me! Thank you. All right, proficiency. There we go. Okay. So we're level 10. So now I'm going to go to the overworld and I'm going to equip the DVM set that I was telling you guys about. So uh, let's just do that real quick. Alright, let's equip the training vest. Alright, there we go. Perfect. See the chest. Two star, dust star duster. Perfect. We also got black diver. I might be able to equip to craft a black diver soon, I'm not gonna lie. I just need uh, some umber obsidian. Alright, let's keep let's go up, up to the overworld, but I need urchins first. Uh where's the urchins? I'm actually not too sure where they are. Let me see. I think it might be to the left side of here. Probably. Perfect, and let's just let's just server hop this one spot until we get like 99 urchins. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I think I might have enough uh, urchins. So let me just let me beat the enforcer now, and go back to the overworld. And yeah, 
I'm gonna craft my insanity pots, and we're gonna be balling. Find it funny how people would rather stack barrels to get um up, than rather just just do it in the normal way by over, like uh ringing all the bells. They'd rather they'd rather just stack the barrels, which I don't blame them. It is quicker, but uh. There always has to be one person that rings the bells and opens it for the entire server, so that guy's an MVP. That guy is selfless. Or that guy's probably a freshie that doesn't know what bells are. Alright. It's time to fight the Enforcer. We have some good ping. I'm just going to have Warriors for Spite real quick. Alright, let's go beat the Enforcer at level 10. Perfect. Mr. Enforcer, today is your reckoning day. Alright, Mr. Enforcer. Bam! Oh. Alright, let's win these. There we go. Perfect, we killed the Enforcer. Uh, okay, good. Let's go back to the surface, craft our insanity potions, and equip the shield for the talents. Alright, there we go. We have 25 Insanity Potions. So yeah, this is definitely enough to get us Herak Sutra. And let's just get the uh, the shield now. And then we can go back down. No, oh, and the DVM kit. Yeah, the shield and the DVM kit. I almost forgot. And I would have had to go back up, sadly. Alright, let's do that now. Also, since, since I'm in the overworld now, um, I think I'm going to go to Vigils to train my Fortune. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to Golems to... Uh, train my strength and then uncap my strength because I definitely have enough XP to get to level 12 at least So instead of just auto clicking in the depths, let me just uh, actually like train normally All right We have all the items now All right, uh, we have the we have the DVM set now. Let me just Toggle all this because this looks so ugly, but basically I think we have we have 61% damage versus monsters now, which is very good that's actually very good. Let me just toggle literally everything because this looks so ugly on me. Alright. I think... What are we missing? Oh, I think this might be a scarf item. Yeah. Okay. So we have 61% damage versus monsters. And before I go back to, to, the, to the surface, I mean to the depths, I'm just going to buy a dumbbell. And I'm also going to buy a new training vest. Then I'm going to go vigils. Get 50 fortitude, and then I'm gonna go to lower Resia, get 75 strength, and then uncap my strength as well. So let's just do that now. I should probably also turn in my black diver somatic. Let's see if I have any of the ingredients for it as well. Let me turn in the black diver somatic. There we go. And let's see, what do I need for this? So the only thing I'm missing is one megalodon hide and level 15. All right, let me just buy the dumbbell now, and let me just sell all this stuff as well. What is bro doing? Why is bro just standing there in the rain? And hopefully I, f I can find a better shield because this shield looks so ugly, I'm not gonna lie. I'm waiting for him to do a little spinning attack because that's where you really get the strength. Yeah, you get a ton of strength from this, so much. Alright, there we go. Let's see what we get. Showstopper. Alright, I'm gonna burn Showstopper. I'm gonna get Unwavering Resolve. Oh, health pack. Alright, I'm getting health pack. And then I'm also gonna get uh, Knight's Rally. There we go, and of course let's just let's just go proficiency, and uh, yeah, let's let's get our fortitude up to 50, and let's get our strength up to 75, and then 90. Wait a minute, I just realized something. The the 90 talent card is a legendary. Did I burn one of the talents I needed for a million ton piercer? Hold on, let me check. No way. I'm checking the wiki. Hold on. Oh my god, I burned bulldozer, and I need bulldozer for. I'm stupid. I'm actually stupid. I need bulldozer for a million ton piercer. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the shrine that allows you to unburn cards, and then I'm just gonna unburn bulldozer and get that uh, later. All right, that seems like a good plan. All right, that's the golem down. Let me train my strength. G yeah, these golems give us so much strength. Jesus. I have. Oh my god, they give so much. All right. I see two golems there. My training vest, vest is on. There we go. No. 
my strength a little bit too. There we go. Shield Breaker, Potion Quaffer, uh, no, yes. Exoskeleton, perfect. And let's just roll two. Magical Resolve, that's so useless for this build. Oh crap! I just realized something. I need to loot my loot bag because I had I had a lot of this stuff for Black Dive versus Matic. So I need to go back now. Yeah, a lot of the stuff in my loot bag was literally everything I needed for Black Diver. I even lost the Bless... No, I didn't lose the Bless Gem, but I lost a lot. Okay, I need to go back. Oh my god, I lost my potions too. No, my potions. I literally lost so much. Hopefully no one looted my bag or else I'm going to be like mad. Because I had so much stuff that I needed. No. I, how did I let myself die to golems? That's kind of crazy. All right, my loot bag is all the way over there. Please don't tell me someone looted my my stuff, or I'm I'm gonna cry. Oh, I have the potions still. What? What? My potions? Oh my god, whatever. Let me just get everything. Bro, they need to fix the glitch where you can only take one potion. Now I only have 13 mind breaking veins, which I still think is enough. But damn, right now I should probably unburn. Uh, bulldozer. So let me do that real quick. I'm also gonna uncap strength as well since I'm here, so I don't have to do it later. Okay, I'm fairly sure the place I need to go to is literally over there. So it's time to fall. There we go. There's usually a mud skipper that uh, that spawns there, so hopefully I don't die to the mud skipper because uh, I'm gonna rage if I do. All right, I'm literally zero percent health. So if I die to the wait, I can just knock this guy for a health pack. Yeah, you see that mud skipper over there? Yeah, if that guy hit, hit me once, I would have died. But not anymore. Let's see if he would have hit me. Oh, I would have died. If I did get a health pack, I would have died. Go, 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 go. Alright, there we go. Bam! Alright, there we go. Strength unbounded. Alright, I'm just gonna reset onto my boat now. And then I'm gonna unburn Bulldozer so I can get Million Ton Piercer. I still can't believe I, I uh, burned it. Bro? Where did bro come from? Sup? <laughs> I'm bro's zesty ferryman, bro. Bro got the earrings and bro got the the ferryman perm. All right, then I guess this guy's coming with us. Bro, I, I don't even know where he came from. I guess he was gliding above the boats. Oh, this guy's calling we. That makes things a lot easier, I'm not gonna lie. All right, also I should probably ask him if he has a shield. By the way, do you have a shield? Yeah. All right, so he's a bear shield for us that we're gonna use uh, until the end of time because this shield just looks so ugly I'm not gonna lie guys. This shield is looks abominable. I think bro's lost. I think bro is actually lost. Oh, nope. He found it. I'm not gonna lie The vote would have been a better option. You're right <laughs> Oh Bro the, the gaps are so s small, but he still manages to like fall in each one of them. Somehow. I don't know how. Oh, there we go. And it's it's inside Miner's Landing. I made a video on its location, but I can't remember. It's like inside. It's like all the way inside. Come on. Ow. Alright, there we go. Let's see. And yep, this is where we have to go. Let me, no, let me up, let me up, let me up. Fairman! Fairman, get up here! I'm gonna help him. I'll help you, Fairman. No one's left behind. Oh my god, they are training my fortune like crazy. There we go. Yeah, Jesus, they're training my fortune like actually crazy. Yeah, it's here. There we go. Alright. I need to unburn. Uh, let's see. Bulldozer. All right, is it unburned? Thank you. Thank you. I need to train my fortune now. All right, we're. All right, guys. So we're just gonna go down to the depths, and we're gonna get Herrick Sutra, and then after the roots, we can try of order. Probably. I think I can level up now as well. Let me just be on my boulder, so I can't tell well. Up, oh, level up. Let's see what we get. Okay, aggressive. I don't need this. Oh, ready or not is really good in PvE. That's so good because you're constantly going in and out of combat. It's actually such a uh, lifesaver. I also want, let's see, 
I'm gonna get a pack mule and let's see what else and bulldozer there we go perfect oh whoa thank you good luck okay shout out to him that guy was cool let's train our strength a little bit and let's go find a jellyfish oh my god I'm two tapping jellyfish good good lord all right we have 90 strength so we're no longer gonna be increasing our strength at all now all we have to increase is our fortitude by one and that's it so let's increase it by one. Oh, Alpha Sharko. Let's see how fast I kill it now with the DVM set I might level. Youch! Alright, come here. Oh my god. Oh! 54 tooth! Yay! Perfect. Oh my god! I'm doing so much damage. Alright, we have our, our stats now. So uh, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna, first thing I'm gonna equip the the shield he gave me. Perfect. Now my shield doesn't look so ugly. And now let's just keep going up. Come on, let's just beat up this crab. Oh no, a freshie! There we go. Uh, nothing was good inside the chest. Oh, Meg hide. Uh, we now have all the ingredients for a uh, black diver, but we have to be level 15 as well. Yeah, at level 13, I'm doing so much damage, especially because of the DVM set. You know, I could probably get up to 80% DVM if I had better rings that gave um, DVM. I'm missing two rings, and those would give me 14 DVM if they're both 7%. Alright, bring me down to layer 2. Oh, I need to be level 15. Uh-oh, I need someone to open this for me. Okay, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Thank you. Thank you, fine, I'm going down to layer 2. Let's, uh, let's drink our potions so we can get insane. There we go, and let's uh, let's keep drinking them, cause we need we need to be like actually insane. Our sanity needs to crumble insane. All right, I think we're good now. Let's go down a little bit. Let's talk to the guy. Bam, Herrick Sutra. So now we can wipe. All right, so we have Herrick Sutra now. And, um, okay, so now I need one heavy weapon, one agility, and one intelligence. So let me get the heavy weapon out first. Where's the weapon manual? There we go. Alright, now let's do the agility. Uh, where's that? Oh, there, there it is. Okay, we leveled up. Let's see what we get. To the finish. And I'm also gonna freeze unfazed. Yeah, I'm gonna freeze un. Actually, I'm freezing turtle shell. Yeah, I'm gonna get to the finish. Million ton piercer. Okay, let's get you. We also need to um row two. Okay, we got turtle shell. And let's see what else we get. Please unfazed. Give us unfazed. Okay, so now we actually didn't get all the tons we needed. We still need we still need unfazed, right guys? So how we're gonna get unfazed is we're gonna do shrine of blast me. So let's just do that real quick. Also, let me get one intelligence as well. Alright, there we go. And uh, let's just go to Shrine of Blast Me and then we can Shrine of Order. Oh. Oh my god. 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 I'm wiped. I'm wiped. I'm wiped. I'm wiped. I need to run. Alright, there we go. Alright, we're here. Let me just break down the door with my strong left. Hi yeah. Boom. Alright. Let me come inside. Yes, please. Let's level up. Let's see what flaw we get as well. Simple. Okay, I don't really mind simple as well. Because I am deep down, so I get a lot of like stuff. Alright, obviously I'm burning this. I'm getting unfazed. Thresher claws. Yes, please. Aggressive posture. I'm going to burn you. And what I'm actually going to do is... uh, I mean, I'll get, I'll get this posture. Why not? Return to the Dark Ages. Um, I mean, why not, right? Why not? Okay. So that's all the taunts we can get, and now let's just shrine of order. Also, wait, I just realized something. I can equip um black divers now. Hold on, let me get the land real quick. Did we get it? Yes, we do. Oh lord, we're dripped out. Oh lord, we're dripped. All right, guys, let's just go to shrine of order now. All right, guys, we're at shrine of order, and let's just shrine of order right now. Okay. Let's see. Everything looks good. Yes. All right, perfect. Now let's take a look at our stats. Now all we have to train is a Jody, and then Intelligence, and then rest into Heavy Weapon, and let's see our cards now. Alright, 
Let's get Gourmet. Let's also get Endurance Runner. And I'm also going to get Nola Flying Clarity as it's an essential talent that I definitely need. And I wish I had some aces so I can burn this. But for now, let's just get Spinning Swordsman. And let's roll two. All right, Vitality. And let's see what else we have. Okay, more Vitality. Uh, let's kill this guy real quick. Okay. My parry game is on point right now. I'm not going to lie. Oh, all right. He lost. I'm not going to lie. Dying to a PvE build is kind of crazy. But, oh well. You know, some people do struggle against PvE builds. So, what can you say? All right. So, as I was saying, we finally Shrine, Shrine of Ordered. And, yeah. In... In part 2, I'm going to level up Agility, Intelligence, also Heavy Weapon, and this build is actually one of the best PvE builds ever. As I said before, it does over 2,000 damage to mobs in a single hit. It's so good. So, I'll see you guys in part 2. Also, please subscribe. If you do, I'll mail this puppy or e kitty to your house. It really just depends on which one you guys like. And yeah, um, I can't wait for part 2. It's going to be such a fun PvE build, even better than pre-nerf. Um, uh, PvE builds, so get ready for that guys and yeah, I'll see you guys later and bye bye